As SpaceX prepares to embark on its fourth Starship flight in approximately six weeks, the teams at Starbase have achieved yet another significant milestone. The upcoming Starship slated for Flight S-29 successfully completed its inaugural static fire test. Confirmed by SpaceX, this test marked a full-duration firing of all six engines at the South Texas launch site, lasting approximately five to six seconds without any issues. We eagerly anticipate the rollout of Booster 11 for testing ahead of the next flight. Recently, a noteworthy development was spotted by Starship Gazers at Massey's test site, a new water-cooled flame diverter for the static fire test stand at Massey's. SpaceX's relentless pursuit of perfection underscores its commitment to swiftly advancing Starship into a fully operational rocket poised to revolutionize space exploration. In a separate event, SpaceX achieved its 29th successful mission of the year with the launch of another batch of Starlink satellites into low Earth orbit, designated as Starlink 646. This mission saw a Falcon 9 rocket lifting off from SLC-40 in Florida at 7.42 p.m. Eastern Time. Notably, the first stage booster, E-1078, completed its eighth flight, demonstrating the efficacy of SpaceX's reusable rocket technology. Following stage separation, the booster gracefully returned to Earth, touching down on the drone ship, a short fall of Gravitas. Stage one landing leg deploy. Stage one landing confirmed. Thank you for tuning in to this brief update. Stay tuned for more exciting developments in the next video.